विश्व हमारे सामूहिक प्रयासों का सिद्धांत है कॉमन बट डिफ्रेंसिएटेड रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटीज दैट रिमेन्स द फोकस ऑफ इंडिया स्टैंड ऑन क्लाइमेट चेंज एंड टेकिंग दिस एज अ सेंट्रल पॉइंट इंडिया विल अनाउंस इट्स कार्बन गैस एमिशन टारगेट्स और इंटेंडेड नेशनली डिटर्मिन कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन और आई एन डी सीज ऑन गांधी जयंती दैट्स अक्टूबर द सेकेंड द आई एन डी सीज ऑफ कंट्रीज विल फॉर्म द बेसिस फॉर क्लाइमेट नेगोसिएशंस एट द यूनाइटेड नेशंस क्लाइमेट चेंज समिट इन पैरिस इन डिसम्बर एवरी कंट्रीज इज एक्सपेक्टेड टू अनाउंस इट्स कार्बन गैस एमिशन कट्स बिफोर द बिग क्लाइमेट चेंज समिट इन पैरिस we had sought permission to declare our indcs on the 2nd of october as you all know the deadline is the 1st of october but the the 2nd of october has a special significance for us for all of us because it is the birth anniversary of mahatma gandhi a person who was passionately committed to the cause of environment who was a champion uh, of uh, sustainable development many believe climate change policy which will be announced on gandhi jayanti will be a major one During his speech at the UNGA, Prime Minister talked about climate justice, highlighting the need to shift focus so that the interest of the weakest section of the society can be preserved. Climate justice is a catch-all phrase to put focus on India's standard position, that is, that the developed countries must bear larger responsibility for environmental degradation. Till now, more than 55 countries, including the United States and China, have announced their carbon emission cuts. The US announced that it would cut its greenhouse gas emissions by 26 to 28 percent by the year 2025, and China said that it would cap its greenhouse gases by the year 2030. But as India announces its climate commitments, the country will be balancing contentious climate change issue alongside protecting the development needs of 1.2 billion Indians. Siddhant Sibal, DD News, New Delhi.